it's Dana, as you know, your director with the Westinger team. And so now that you have joined the team, you are probably experiencing a lot of questions as to where do I go now, what do I do, who do I say, stuff to, who do I call. And as we referenced in the welcome video that you should have watched by now, what you're going to want to do is pull out the green succeed with us workbook, which is this one, okay? You and I are going to work through that just a little bit today um, together so that you can get a better handle on what's going on in your new business. And in case you have some questions, write them down, and then you and I can chat about them over the phone, okay? So, open it up, and what I want you to do is notice on page two, it says our commitment. Okay, I want to just read this to you just because I think it's, I think it serves a good purpose too. Congratulations on becoming a Pampered Chef Consultant. The good news is you are in business for yourself and not by yourself. I love that statement. Your recruiter or director, me, your teammates, and a host of home office co-workers will provide ongoing training and support coupled with cheers and recognition. And this is so true, I cannot say it enough. This is just amazing business that you have um, now joined. And so I want you to have a good time. I want you to relax. I want you to share your fears with me. I want you to share your joys with me, share everything with me. And that way I can help you better and coach you a lot better, okay? So let's go ahead and get started in this workbook. So flip on over to page three. You'll see there our mission statement. You'll see what we are um, proud of doing as we pay it forward to a couple of different charities. Um, you'll see that there. And you will also see and you will experience this as you are out and about meeting new people. Um, you are going to experience people saying things like, oh, I love the Pampered Chef, especially when you are making these little out and about um, chance meetings and um, making contacts with perfect strangers, which I highly encourage you do, um, especially if you're shy like the way I was when I first started. It will actually help you um, get over the shyness a little bit quicker. If that's something that you want to overcome, I highly recommend just carrying on a random conversation with a perfect stranger. Okay, first things first. On page four, you are going to set your goals. Now, this is super important because the success of your business counts on you setting goals, working these goals, and achieving these goals. And I'm here to help you do that, okay? And so the first thing that you're going to do is you are going to follow step one, and you are going to look at tangible and intangible goals. We all want a little something in our pocket, something that we can hold on to that shows us that we've done a good job. And the next thing is we might want something that's you know, more to the heart, maybe um, recognition where we've never received it before, um, someone to be proud of us, to be proud of ourselves. That was one of mine, definitely. I wanted something that I could be proud of uh, when it came to something like this. And then what I want you to do is I want you to create a visual. And if you're not an artist, as I'm not, don't worry about it. Just create the visual anyway. Draw your goal out. Your goal is to take your husband on an all-expense-paid trip with the Pampered Chef, then draw that there. You know, draw you guys going on a cruise ship or draw your family going to Disney, something that you can really get a hold of and something that you can call your own that you can look at daily and say, you know what, this is why I'm doing the Pampered Chef, okay? So flip on over and you will see on page five, step two, breaking down your goals into achievable steps. This is great because... You're not going to just look at the big goal, per se, of, um, I want a trip with my family. Okay, you got to know how to get there, and you got to break it down into very small, attainable steps. So the way you're going to do that is, how much money do I need to earn monthly, on a monthly basis? What is that magic dollar amount? Is it $500? Is it $1,000? Is it $1,200? What does that amount of money look like to you? Okay, you're going to write that amount there. How many shows a week would I like to do? Not how many shows a week do you think you can book, but how many shows a week am I able to do physically? So I've got um, family nights on Mondays. I've got church on Wednesdays. And I like doing date nights with my husband on Fridays. So it looks like I could do Tuesdays and Thursdays, maybe a Saturday or Sunday here and there. 
So figure those up and write that number down. Okay, and you're also going to see that you're going to earn at least 20% commission, which is great. You're not going to have any inventory to keep. You're not going to have a whole lot of extra expenses like other home-based businesses might have. But if you have done other home-based businesses, you might be familiar with extra things that you have to do, which, thank goodness, we don't have to do that with Campus Chef. Okay, now if you'll look down at the potential monthly earnings chart, I want you to notice that by doing eight shows a month, which is only two shows a week, you're going to earn, let's say you have a $550 show average, which is our company average, you're going to earn 25% commission and $1,110. It's a far cry from $400, isn't it? So now, how many shows will you do <laughs> in a month? That number will probably differ from up above where it says, how many shows would I like to do? Okay. So flip the page on over to page six, and you heard us reference page um, six as far as Camper Chef Dollars goes in our welcome video, but we're going to explain a little bit more about this now. Okay, so the new consultant rewards program is something that's absolutely amazing, and it's there to help keep you going, looking forward to something as you're in your first 30, 60, and 90 days of your business, which is a very important part, and yes, you see my dog walking in the background. <laughs> So, in your first 30, 60, and 90 days, you can earn tons and tons of Camper Chef dollars, and these can be used to buy um, more products, pay for some training that um, we do quarterly, or not quarterly, rather, but um, uh, twice a year we do a spring launch and fall launch, and you can use those Camper Chef dollars to pay for things like that, for new catalogs, new products, whatever you want. And so, what you want to do is create a wish list of things that you would like to have that did not come in your new consultant kit, okay? Now, the Pamper Chef dollars, one thing I want to add is that they are unlimited. You can earn a ton. You can earn one to two, three, four hundred dollars, which is about average, or you can rock it out. You can be like that airplane we talked about in the welcome video, zooming down the runway and taking off and earning a ton. We have had a new consultant, when she joined our team, she earned $1,700 in Pamper Chef dollars. And that was because she was telling everybody about her new business. She was doing this, and she was not going to fail. She was like, I am doing this thing. And so she booked a ton of shows, and she had people join her team in the first in the first 90 days. Okay, So every four shows you do, you're going to earn some Pamper Chef dollars. You know, you're going to earn some with $1,250 in sales. You're going to earn some with $5,000 in sales. And for every time you have a new recruit join your team. Now, as we said in the um, welcome video, starting this business truly is easy. It's one, two, three. Okay? Now, we're going to talk about three, two, one. Okay? This is a true plan for success on page seven. You're going to see three contacts a day, holding two shows a week, and having one new team member join your team per month. Don't think you can go wrong with that. This is the mark of a successful business. And... To add to that, you will earn a Camper Chef vacation. All expenses paid when you follow this plan. So I think that by following this plan and earning a vacation would actually please you quite a bit, now wouldn't it? All right, so flip on over to pages 8 and 9. This is something that we covered in the um, new consultant welcome video um, that I've referenced already. So on pages 8 and 9, those are the scripts listed that you're going to be using when you call your list of 100 or your Frank's list, which is also featured on pages 10 and 11. So at this point, you should have some shows on your calendar, and you should have called some of these people. And if you have not, that's okay. Go ahead and start doing that today. Whenever you're finished with this call, or this video rather, go ahead and try calling a few people using those scripts um, from your Frank's list, okay? And also on pages 12 and 13, we reference that in the video as well. And these are words that you can say when talking to people about this business and how amazing it truly is. And you can invite people, even though you may not know a lot about this business, you can invite people right away to join your team and do this with you. Hey, let it be a partnership. It would be so much fun to work with a friend, don't you think? And go through things together and help each other out at shows and vendor events 
So I'm sure that by now you can think of a really good friend that you would absolutely love to work with, don't you think? Now, let's flip on over to page 14, okay? Partner with your hopes for success. This is a fabulous, fabulous uh, couple of pages here. It is how to maximize your sales, getting great sales, great bookings, and recruit leads. And this is the way you're going to do it, is by host coaching, which is so important. And one tip, here's a, here's a little phrase that you can remember. A show worth having is a show worth coaching. So if someone tries out for the football team, they can't just put on a pair of um, pads and a uniform and run out there and know exactly what to do. they got to be coached, right? The same is with your host. They can't just get a hostess packet in the mail and know everything to do. So they're going to need some coaching from you right away. So go ahead and start this practice from day one of coaching your host properly. And that is going to ensure that you get great success, great sales, great attendance, and great bookings from your shows. Okay? And this even gives you, I love this, on page uh, 15, it gives you what to do for calls 1, 2, and 3. Okay? Now, planning your cooking show. You've got them booked. You've talked to your hostess. Now what are you going to do? One thing I recommend is when you're done with this video, I highly recommend watching Cooking Shows in Action. It's a video that's playing in your New Kentucky Kit. So I want you to watch that. But I also want you to work on pages 16 and 17. Um, these are some tips on how to plan out your cooking show properly. Okay, this is um, telling you what came in your kit, talk about how to work with your show outline, how to wrap up the show, how to begin the show. So it's some really, really good tips. And also, free online, 24-7, is an online training center um, on Consultant Corner, which is specifically for consultants. You can watch videos and do training videos on how to sell, say, the deep covered bacon, or how to sell the knives, or even how to get bookings out and about. I highly recommend going ahead and starting with those videos also. They're only 20 minutes long, and you're going to absolutely love them, and you're going to learn a lot in those videos. All right, on page 18, working smart. Hmm, my husband always tells me, honey, work smarter, not harder. So I love to take that uh, piece of advice and put it into my business. So making a power hour, using five to ten minute pockets of time to make phone calls to people. Because sometimes if you take this list of 100, it looks very overwhelming. You don't even know where to start. So start with one. And then move on to the second call. And then the third call. And then the fourth. And pretty soon, you're going to find, you know what, I'm consistently making four or five calls a day. This is easy. I can totally do this. And you can. You can do this. Okay? And I love this. This is a checklist on page 18 about how to set up your office, how to gather basic supplies, some of the things that you're going to need. I love this. This is amazing. And finally, on page 19 is the Pamper Chef Career Plan. This is going to show you how to maximize your income potential, which I think we all want to do, right? Want to get paid more for what we're doing. And the way you're going to do that is by adding those new team members to your team. It doesn't mean that you're doing this full-time as a career and dropping your day job if you work full-time outside of the home or even part-time outside of the home. It doesn't mean that. It just means you want to maximize your potential, okay, and your earning potential at that. So you can earn extra rewards, extra bonuses, and definitely extra commission by having new team members join your team. Now, what I want you to consider is this. Even though you may not know a lot about the Pamper Chef business right away, that's okay. You can call me. I'm happy to help you every step of the way. Talk to new consultants. Um, talk to people who might be interested and have some questions that you may not be able to answer right now. That's okay. Give me a call. Shoot me an email or send me a text. Okay? I'm happy to help you every step of the way. And I want you to notice that, yes, at the bottom of the page, you can promote to director in 90 days. Director is a great place to be. You get lots of free products, lots of exclusive benefits, and definitely lots of extra commission. So this is a wonderful place to be. I've definitely enjoyed being a director. And you know what? I've enjoyed being your director so far. You may be new to the business, but I love having each and every one of you on the team. And it is a true joy to be a part of the Pamper Chef for the past seven and a half years. And I look forward to our team growing by leaps and bounds every single day. 
and I look forward to our team promoting to an executive director team. We are well on our way, and you have joined one of the fastest growing teams in the entire area. So I applaud you, I congratulate you, and I welcome you from my office to now your office. Congratulations, welcome to the team, and I will see you soon. Bye-bye.